Samsung is gearing up for a major foldable push in 2025, and it's not just the usual suspects. Additionally, the company is preparing to launch two more foldables in the second half of the year, a trifold model and a more affordable flip variant. According to Thibel, Samsung Display is currently manufacturing OLED panels for the Galaxy Z Flip 7 and Z Fold 7. Alongside these, the company is working on a trifold device and a budget-friendly Z Flip Fan Edition, both of which could be unveiled in the fourth quarter of 2025. The report also indicates that these foldables may enter mass production as early as next month. This timeline aligns with Samsung's typical foldable release schedule, hinting at a possible July launch similar to previous years. In terms of manufacturing, the front-end process for foldable OLED panels, which follows a bar-type OLED method, is handled in South Korea, while the back-end process is carried out in Vietnam. Once completed, the OLED panels are shipped to Samsung's local assembly plants. These upcoming foldables will mark Samsung's seventh generation of foldable devices. With Apple expected to debut its first foldable device next year, Samsung is aiming to stay ahead by introducing both an innovative tri-fold and a more accessible foldable auction this year. Apple is also expected to source foldable OLED panels from Samsung Display for its future products. This partnership would further solidify Samsung's dominance in the global mobile OLED market. According to the latest reports, it's now confirmed that Samsung will be using a completely upgraded flexible glass in the Galaxy Z Fold 7. This is a full 100% change compared to the previous models. The company is set to introduce the latest generation of foldable display flex glass, promising major improvements in both toughness and overall screen quality. But that's not all. Samsung is reportedly redesigning the internal structure of the Z Fold 7 from the ground up. The new hinge system is said to be more durable than ever, and for the first time it's coming with all new hinge dust protective brushes. This could be a game changer for long-term durability and resistance to wear and tear, especially in dusty environments where older foldables struggled. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 is shaping up to be the toughest foldable smartphone on the market, combining futuristic display tech with structural enhancements that push the boundaries of what a foldable can do. If these leaks hold true, Samsung is clearly listening to feedback and evolving their foldable line to be more reliable and user-friendly than ever. Samsung's upcoming foldable flagship, the Galaxy Z Fold 7, has just made an appearance on Geekbench confirming some of its key specs. The benchmark results show that the US variant, model number SMF966U, is powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 Lite for Galaxy chipset and runs Android 16 Base 1 UI 8. In Geekbench 6.4 testing, the device achieved a single-core score of 3022 and a multi-core score of 9307. While impressive, these scores are likely to improve further before the phone's official launch as it's still in the development phase. This is the second confirmation we've seen of both the chipset and operating system. The Snapdragon 8 Elite for Galaxy features an 8-core CPU with a peak clock speed of 4.47 GHz, ensuring top-tier performance. Interestingly, Samsung plans to debut its new OS, One UI 8 based on Android 16, in the second half of the year, skipping the usual beta cycle that starts in Q3. This aligns with Google's strategy to accelerate Android development and help OEMs release new devices with the latest OS version right out of the box. While this benchmark pertains to a US carrier model, the global version is expected to share identical hardware. Although Samsung is reportedly testing Exynos chips for the Flip lineup, it's unlikely that the Fold series will move away from Snapdragon. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 are expected to launch in July 2025, with rumors also hinting at a possible affordable Flip variant joining the lineup. It's important to highlight that this benchmark is based on an early one UI 8 build, firmware version F966 USQOAOE 7. While it's still in the development phase, the results give us an early glimpse of what to expect from the Z Fold 7 in terms of performance. This also hints at a major shift. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 is likely to launch with One UI 8 right from the start, skipping the Android 15-based One UI 7 entirely. As a result, flagship devices like the Galaxy S24 series, which just received the stable One UI 7 update earlier this month, might benefit from two major One UI upgrades in 2025, one UI 7 now and One UI 8 possibly after August. According to reports, Samsung is aiming to release the stable One UI 8 build alongside the launch of the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Z Flip 7 in August 2025. Ahead of that, the beta program is expected to kick off, with the Galaxy S25 series reportedly first in line to test the new software. Now that we're in April 2025, rumors and leaks around the Galaxy Z Fold 7 are becoming more frequent. 
Some of the most exciting reports suggest a major camera upgrade with a foldable possibly featuring a new 200 megapixel main sensor, a big leap from the 50 megapixel wide lens used in the Z Fold 6. Beyond the camera, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 is expected to have a refined form factor, being slightly taller and wider when unfolded compared to its predecessor. With more leaks expected in the coming weeks, there's plenty to look forward to regarding Samsung's next foldable flagship. A trusted industry insider has revealed that the Galaxy Z Fold 7 will feature a larger camera bump compared to its predecessor, the Galaxy Z Fold 6. That naturally raises the question, is the Fold 7's camera actually getting an upgrade? According to previous leaks, the answer is yes. The primary sensor is reportedly being bumped up to a massive 200 megapixel, a significant leap from the 50 megapixel sensor used in the Fold 6. While it's not confirmed whether the bigger bump is directly tied to the upgraded sensor, it's likely. That said, the size difference probably won't be noticeable unless you're measuring it closely with tools. It's worth noting that despite the camera improvements, the Fold 7 setup still won't quite match the capabilities of the Galaxy S25 Ultra. However, it's still expected to deliver excellent photo quality and will likely rank among the top foldable smartphones of 2025. The slightly larger camera bump might cause the Fold 7 to wobble a bit more on flat surfaces, but it's unlikely to cause much fuss, especially with Apple reportedly planning to launch the iPhone 17 with a massive pixel-inspired camera island. Compared to that, the Fold 7's bump will fly under the radar. Reliable leaker Ice Universe is back with a live look at the Galaxy Z Fold 7 and Flip 7, providing final confirmation of the devices. Recent leaks from third-party accessory manufacturers have provided fresh insights into the design choices Samsung has made for its upcoming Galaxy Z Flip 7 and Z Fold 7. As the anticipated July launch date approaches, accessory vendors seem to have received final design data, giving us a clearer look at these next-generation foldable devices. The Galaxy Z Flip 7 is set to receive one of its most significant cover screen upgrades in years. Meanwhile, the Galaxy Z Fold 7 is expected to feature subtle yet practical design refinements aimed at enhancing user experience. A third-party transparent case designed for the Galaxy Z Flip 7 reveals the cover screen's new layout. This display now dominates the entire upper half of the device's back panel, signifying a substantial improvement in screen real estate. This revised design aligns with previous reports suggesting Samsung's plans to deliver a more immersive external display experience. The Galaxy Z Fold 7 Elite screen protector suggests that the cover display will be slightly wider and taller than that of the Fold 6. This change aligns with earlier CAD renderings and previously reported dimensions, hinting at a broader and more practical outer screen. The Galaxy Z Flip 7's cover screen is expected to adopt a Moto Razr-like full-view design, maximizing the display area while integrating the rear camera sensors within the screen itself. This marks a departure from Samsung's earlier folder icon-inspired cover screen design, offering a sleeker and more functional look. Meanwhile, the Galaxy Z Fold 7's cover screen is reportedly expanding to 73mm in width, enhancing usability. The outer display is expected to grow to approximately 6.5 inches, while the inner foldable screen is anticipated to measure nearly 8.2 inches, providing a more spacious interface for multitasking and media consumption. These design adjustments reflect Samsung's ongoing efforts to improve the functionality and visual appeal of its foldable devices, positioning the Galaxy Z Flip 7 and Z Fold 7 as significant upgrades in the foldable smartphone market. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.